Wow! I am very intelligent, and I'd rather talk about that. I'm trying to sell my book. Okay. Now it says here you wanted to be a man so much, you dress up like one. Well, that's a load of crap, my dear. More misogynistic propaganda. I hate men. Can't bear them. I think they're a complete waste of time and space, quite frankly, and a disaster for the planet. Me too. I just got done. Oh, well, it is unfortunate you measure... Don't move a muscle, chump! Who you really are. Let's talk about me. Okay, so tell me about your book. You hate men a lot, and you dressed up like one, and now you've written a book about it, right? More or less, as I I've always been fascinated with the world of men. Revolted, of course, but fascinated. Now, as an academic, I can get paid to write a book about pretty much anything. As long as I give it a complicated title. Are you with me, gorgeous? Ooh, I think so. Good. Then hold my hand. It helps me. No! Okay, okay, sorry. Don't be so weird. God, everywhere I go, just like the university won't let me display my beautiful and sensual woodcuts in the student comments, it makes me so angry! What was I? You were talking about yourself? Oh, of course. The ego is a dangerous thing, especially in my eyes. I'm a young Anyway. What I did was dress up like a man and enter into the man world. I could... The first chapter, I was a goof. These sexists spent all day on the talking about us. I was expected to sit around and talk about what I had done. Of course, I had to, so as not to be in the company. So what's the name of the Yes, as mentioned hitherto, my book has a very, very obtuse to Being and separate. To the building sites, a woman's journey into the mill site. Huh? What? I'll admit it's not very catchy. Yeah. What I do is not about the entire point. It's about exploration. Okay. So I entered the world of men in disguise. I was dressed like a man. 